Hey everyone, it's Ken here from Northern Viking Everyday. Today I've got a quick GoPro tutorial for you. I'm gonna be showing you how to update the firmware manually on your GoPro Hero 13 Black. So this is without using the GoPro Quick App on your phone. It's really quite simple to do. Maybe you're struggling to do it with the GoPro Quick App. You could try this out and doing it manually. So let's go ahead and dive right into it. So there's two steps to updating the firmware here on your GoPro Hero 13 Black manually. The first is removing the micro SD card and plugging that into a computer and copying the files over to the micro SD card. And the second is the actual update process on the GoPro. So we're gonna start out on my computer. The first thing we need to do though is remove the memory card from our GoPro Hero 13 Black. Really quite simple to do. There's a little side door on here. You can pull that back and it opens up pull out the battery, it's a little bit easier that way. I do have a full tutorial on this process, I'll link that below, but you can give the memory card here a little push and that'll release it, kind of ejects it out. Now, the other thing you need to do is plug this into your computer. So hopefully your computer has a micro SD card slot. If it doesn't, like mine doesn't, I have these little adapters that allow you to plug them into a USB-A or a USB-C port and those have little slots for a micro SD card. So I'm gonna go ahead and plug this right into my adapter here. If you need one of these, I'll link them below in the description. They're not too expensive. Slide that in there and then I'll just plug this into my computer. So jumping over to my PC here, I'm on the GoPro support page for the firmware update instructions. I'll have this link below in the description so you can find it. It does talk about updating on the Quick App, but if you scroll down, you can see it shows you updating with Windows as well as Mac. Now the process would be very similar on both of them. The biggest difference is how you copy files to the micro SD card. Now, I do wanna point out you do need to have at least a 50% battery charge in your GoPro Hero 13 Black, and you do need to copy the files to the root level of the SD card. So don't put them in any folders or anything like that. So let's go ahead and get started here. It says download the update files here. You can go ahead and select that. It'll take us to the next page. It actually talks about the latest release and what it does. So today we're doing version 1.3. And then down here, you can update the camera manually. So if you're doing Mac, click on Mac. If you're doing Windows, we'll click on Windows. Again, there's more instructions here if you do want to dig deeper into that. But we're gonna go ahead and download the update. It's starting to download it there. And the zip folder download is complete. So let's go ahead and open up our file explorer here so we can head to the bottom. Now I have a shortcut here for the file explorer. You can go ahead and left click on that. If you don't have that, head on over to your start menu here. We can right click on our start menu. And in here we should see file explorer. You can left click on that. That will load up the file explorer on our system. Now from here we need to find the downloaded zip folder. So more than likely it's in your downloads folder here if that's where your computer is set to. Lines right there. And to make this easier, I'm gonna just drag that over to my desktop. So I'll hold down my left mouse button and just drag it over to my desktop here. Then I can minimize this. And this is a zip folder. So we do need to extract that. So you can see there's a little zipper on there. We're gonna right click on it. And you should see the option here that it says extract all. You can left click on that. And it's gonna allow you to select a destination for that to be unzipped to. So it's automatic on my desktop, that's where I want it. If you do wanna change that location, you need to hit the browse button here and you can search for a new location. We do need it to go into an update folder. You can see it says update there at the end, which is what we need. So I'm gonna leave it right there. We'll hit extract. It's gonna start extracting that and it actually automatically opened it up. So I'm just gonna shut that. And there it is on my desktop. So this one with the zipper, we don't need that any longer. I'm just gonna move that into my recycle bin. But we need to copy this one here without the zipper onto our micro SD card. So again, I'm gonna open up my file explorer and we need to look for our micro SD card. So over here under this PC, I've got all my drives and the micro SD card on mine is this one that says USB drive D. Yours could be a different letter. So you'll have to look through and it does have GoPro files on it that the GoPro puts on it. So this is the one I'm looking for. And we need to copy this update folder off of my desktop into here. So I'm just gonna drag and drop that over there like that. It's gonna copy it in there. Make sure it's in our root menu so you can see it without going into any other folders. And it just says update. It doesn't have a one after it if you downloaded it multiple times. It just needs to just say update like that. And from there, we can go ahead and eject this. So I'll eject it. 
and then we can go ahead and put that into our GoPro. So we'll move on to step two, which is updating the GoPro. So we'll put the memory card back in here. We'll open up the side and slide that in, give it a push so it stays. And then we'll put the battery back in like that and close the battery door. And then now we can go ahead and turn on our GoPro. So we'll hold that down for a couple of seconds, the button on the side, it'll turn on and it should automatically start updating the GoPro. So we'll let it do its thing here. The screen went black and it turned kind of back on again. And it looks like it's restarting. Update complete, camera will restart. Restarts one more time and the update is complete. And really it's that simple to update your GoPro Hero 13 Black manually without using the GoPro Quick App. So I hope this quick tutorial gave you value. If it did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, take care.